Hi and welcome. It's Megan here. Welcome back to another vlog. We're doing a weekend in my life this time. Um, I'm gonna be tailgating with my family later today. Uh, there's also a Greek festival in town this weekend. So I'm super excited to take you guys along with me. So if you like vlogs, definitely give this a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. So let's get into it. Okay guys, so this is the outfit for today i'm wearing these jeans and this t-shirt from oh they're both from target and then i'm wearing my tevas my aldo brand bag and then these sunglasses that i got from urban outfitters so yeah and i'm on the phone with mom so say hi mom hey y'all hi y'all hey y'all <laughs> And so, yeah, this is the tailgate kind of look for the day. I am in the parking deck at the tailgate place. We're tailgating somewhere. I guess it's on the top of a parking deck. It's close to the stadium, so it's so hard to get here, but um, I'm not sure exactly like where I'm going, but that's what's happening. Going to kind of a UAB uh, tailgate because the game's today. Um, not going to the game. I could have, but I decided not to. But yeah, so let's get ahead and get going. Okay, I didn't die in the porta potty. I'm okay. Oh, well, I had to go though because I really had to pee. But now I'm headed back to the tailgate for a little bit. It's been a few hours now. It's actually like dark. It's seven and I'm finally with mom. We're still thinking about going to the Greek festival because it doesn't close until like 9 30 ish 10 and today's the last day so worst case we'll just get a little bit of food but yeah I look super hot I'm actually kind of tired but it's been a good day so mom's here hi we're walking to the Greek festival uh, I'm so excited I'm excited too I'm out of breath you guys I literally feel like I'm going to die. So sad. I think it's because I've been drinking and I've already walked today. Yeah, I walked earlier. I've done nothing. Oh my God.
it's the next day. Uh, it's like noon. Me and mom are about to go walking and she also gave me some of this new protein powder she got so I'm gonna try it and just make me a smoothie really quick because I haven't eaten anything. I've just had like some coffee so yeah usually when we go walking we'll walk for like uh 45 minutes to an hour uh so I need something on my stomach. I still haven't been to the grocery store of course so I'm just gonna use the frozen fruit I have. This is the cherries and berries blend. I'm gonna throw some lettuce, even though I really like spinach or kale in it. Some flax seeds, trying that new protein powder. This is a serving of it. And then just some almond milk. So I'm gonna make that really quick. And then we're good to go. to go I used one of these like little cups I got a set of these in like the Target dollar section a while ago um, they're a little small but once I just drunk a little bit off the top it fit my whole smoothie mm. this protein powder tastes so much better like it's not it's not very sweet at all which I really like I don't like like super duper sweet protein powders um, so I definitely really like this one. This this one tastes a lot better to me. I'm just wearing something super simple. This like kind of oversized tank from uh, Victoria's Secret Pink. I have on a sports bra from Target underneath. And then these leggings are from the brand Adidas. And then of course my little walking shoe from the brand Brooks. This is the look for today. Special and she reckless. And babe, you're my bestest friend. Yeah, she my bestie. My love for you is endless. Nobody else can end it. And when I get the money back, then baby girl, you can spend it. Oh. And everything is alright. I like how you're doing alright, alright. Like how you think alright. Always on top of you. Ooh, this is so pretty. Yeah, it looks like it. Oh, this is so cute. Guys, we stumbled on an open house and we love open houses, so we had to go check this it out. This microwave is an oven, so this is a convection oven. Oh, that's really cool. Oh, look how it has the cooktop. Oh, look at this pretty bathroom. It's like four levels. Yes. <laughs> Ooh, this is pretty. Look at dogs. She has those crates. Anyway. Look at the Not the coffee shop in the bedroom, girl. This is super cute. Oh, I love this closet. Hello. Hello. How are you? This is amazing. <laughs> Oh, oh wow! We're on that side. That's oh, amazing. Wow. This 
is beautiful. Yes. Double, double head shower. from the bathroom. Wow. So smaller ones have. Are they just two bedrooms? I, I would guess three. Okay. Three. Okay. Ah, this view is beautiful. Here, put air right. like Yeah. Upstairs. I don't know the steps. Let me turn my thing back on now. You guys, they have an elevator. Four, well, for four floors, you kind of would need one. Yeah. We just walked for about 40-ish minutes, not including the time I was walking in the actual open house. I just showed you a few clips of the open house. Y'all guess, how much do y'all think the house? <laughs> Tell them you're gonna buy it for me later, Meg. I'm gonna buy it for you later. Yeah. Okay. You want to live in the mother-in-law suite? Okay, the house had like, I think, was it five bedrooms? Four bedrooms, four, four baths. Four bedrooms, four baths, an elevator, rooftop, two-car garage. But low key, the room upstairs was like a whole separate big ass room. That yeah, I felt like that. I feel like that counts as a fifth room, but the, yeah, I, they yeah. weren't counting that as the room. They I weren't counting, they don't, because they couldn't count it as a bedroom. It was oh, because it was outside. But it had a kitchen in it and a bathroom. Yeah, it yeah. had a kitchenette and a bathroom. Yeah. yeah. It so did. it was kind of like a whole bunch. So five rooms, four baths. It's five like rooms, four baths. But closets galore. Lots of closets, nice kitchen. It was like $1.3 million. I cannot believe they let us into a $1.3 million house. Of course they gonna let us in. <laughs> They were super nice too. We were asking all sorts of questions. <laughs> yeah, I had lots of questions. Mom had lots of questions, but yeah, it was, it was really nice. Um, I, it was a beautiful home. I, I love open houses, so yeah, it, it just made me happy. Cause I, I've always seen that little area from the interstate when I'm driving around town and I'm like, I want to go in one of those so bad. And today there was an open house. So I just feel all happy inside, but. Yeah, we had a pretty good walk. Distance, I come by my side. Everything is green over here. Oh, yeah. Everything you want and think about. No, I got your back all the way. And everything is all right. I like how you're doing all right, all right. Like how you think all right. Always on top of yeah, oh, yeah. Like how you do it all right. Everything good, all right, all right. Like how you think all right. Always on top of guys so it's way later now I'm back at my house and I am just pulling up my computer I've got my all the colorful stuff so this is my like Google Calendar for the week um, since it's Sunday usually at night I like to kind of think about all the content I want to post and then kind of like plan my day and really just um, I've been time blocking to get more stuff done and also okay so I've been time blocking uh, it really helps me to like really I guess pick stuff that's most important to do and get done first but I've also learned that it's helping me to kind of track and see how long it takes me to do stuff like how long it takes me to edit however like part of a youtube video or how long it takes me to edit tiktok videos or how long it takes me to film videos and stuff like that like so i am enjoying that it's been a really good weekend i feel like this is like i did a lot this weekend like most times i literally am just sitting at my house in the weekend doing absolutely nothing like sometimes i won't even leave like i won't even go outside unless to go on my balcony. I'm not kidding. So this time to go to like the tailgate and hang out with my family. It's my dad's side of the family. One of my cousins goes to UAB. So that's why we were uh, hanging out, um, tailgating. And then we went in the game. I, I don't even think I explained that yesterday. We went in the game and um, I wasn't planning to go in the game. I 
I just wasn't really sure. I, I knew for sure I could tailgate and stuff, but I was like, oh, I could go in the game or not. I don't know. And so they had um, an extra ticket. So they were like, just go in the game with us. We're not going to be there too long. And I was like, okay, cool. Because I have never been to a UAB football game. Um, you know, I went to, I went to Auburn. So, <laughs> you know, we're very big on like football games and tailgating and stuff. Um, so this was definitely a different experience. Uh, this That was the quietest football game I've ever been to in my life. Not like throwing shade or anything. <laughs> it's, it's no shade, but like, I don't know. I was just fascinated. It's so interesting to go to that because I think it was just because the stadium wasn't full. So it just wasn't, it wasn't as loud. Like you go to uh, an Auburn game, loud as hell okay you go to uh an alabama game like in tuscaloosa or not even in tuscaloosa but just with the the alabama fans loud okay this this sec alabama football is something serious i didn't know until i went to school i was just like what this is crazy but yeah the so it was very cool to go to like a uab game and to see some of my family and then also afterwards, me and mom went to the Greek festival. It's something they have every year. I'm not sure if they had it last year and stuff because of COVID, but me and mom had been to it a few times when I was younger and she went to it a few times when I was like in Auburn and stuff. But yeah, it's, it's really a cool festival. You get to learn more about like the Greek culture. There's like all sorts of homemade foods and different things that they make. Um, we got there a little late this time, so we didn't get to see everything but it's super cool to go um i think pretty busy jam-packed weekend you know normally i'd be at the house watching what am i watching right now the handmaiden's tale okay that's that's me that's normally what i would have been doing and i also probably should have gone to the grocery store i think i've been saying that for days weeks i don't even know yeah it's probably been about a week now i I need to go to the grocery store. So maybe I'll go tomorrow or not. All right, so I'm about to take my wig off and then put on what sleeping clothes? Probably just a big t-shirt and I'm gonna go to sleep. So I'm gonna go ahead and end this vlog here. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, definitely give it a big thumbs up don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you in my next one. Love you guys. Bye.